Now just a little short video. See, you fit yourself a nice uh, aftermarket clock to get it all stable. But don't think it's all that stable. I have a sticker here with the correct frequency which is 4.32181 MHz. And as you see now it's below that frequency and then it goes above that frequency. That's perfect, now below. And then it will go above, it's now above. So it's not that um, that it just sits there, you see now it's well above. So, so it's, uh, I mean it all doesn't matter because it is within specifications, it's, I think 5 kHz. But still, you know, you would think that when you go and pay somebody big money for the clock, it will be better than the factory one. Well, it isn't. So there you are, sometimes modifying things, or I would even say most of the time modifying things doesn't really bring an appreciable benefit. Other than sort of thinking that it is actually better than it is. Well, thank you very much, and until the next one.